All right, back with my favorite director of strategic alliances and sustainability. Um, Jason, can you introduce yourself? Absolutely. Um, well, my title is, as you mentioned, Director of Strategic Alliances and Sustainability. Uh, I work for Harvard Maintenance. We're actually a building services contractor uh, who services all, four, uh, all, 40, all 50 states uh, across the nation. Um, this is one of my favorite questions uh, that I've asked a lot of executives, and it's about leaders making a difference out there. Um, how are you making a difference in the world today? You know, I'm very fortunate. Uh, I feel like I get to do that each and every day in the position that I'm in of sustainability. Uh, a lot of folks are familiar with the environmental piece as far as making a difference on environmental, whether it's energy or water or, or, the, uh, or the climate, carbon emissions. Uh, but social responsibility, the human capital piece that, that, that I feel like I get to pay it forward and give, give back each and every day. Uh, every customer that I, that I talk with, uh, you know, it's amazing when we can go in there and make just simple adjustments and efficiency um, based on, number one, the people um, or human capital and get the responses back. I'm not sure if you're familiar. Uh, we're actually, we are, our main uh, entity is commercial cleaning. I'll give you an example. We do a lot of nighttime cleaning, as most folks do in the commercial world. Uh, and we're leading a, star, a, a charge both from environmental uh, and a social perspective of day cleaning. As we know, day cleaning is performed pretty much as the norm overseas, uh, but it's really lacks an acceptance here in the United States, and it's unfortunate. Uh, and we see the benefits, obviously, from an environmental perspective for a lot of cost efficiencies and energy usage instead of buildings being lit up like a Christmas tree at nighttime with just the custodial staff running around there or maybe a couple of security officers. Uh, but I'll give you an example. So, just most recently, we transitioned a large uh, downtown facility uh, to a day cleaning, and, and the response was overwhelming. Uh, of course, we communicated appropriately with the, the occupants, was well accepted, addressed all of their concerns. Uh, but I'll tell you that what we didn't really expect was, first of all, a lot of the employees working so late at night, uh, it was their transportation was the issue. Uh, whether they got off too late, whether it was it was a problem, or from a security perspective, uh, we had some issues, obviously, with them taking some of the transportation, public transportation, at, the, at those times at night. So we got a lot of praise as far as reworking that. We were able to participate in regular commuting during the regular work hours, if you will. Mm -hmm. uh, and we even received letters from their children um, thanking us because now their mom and dad get to be home at night with them. Uh, you know, instead of staying at grandma's or a neighbor's, just some examples that we received, uh, helping them with their homework and have that true work-life balance. That is made a difference. You know, and it shows all of us that uh, you can make a difference, one person, group of people at a time, and then when you start multiplying it, how many people you do that with, there's an impact. Uh, I'm very fortunate to be in this position. Uh, you know, I'm very thankful to have a sustainability role um, it kind of evolved. I'm not sure how many other folks are. It's still a growing uh, career, if you will. I actually started in the construction industry on a new construction mm -hmm. side, um, and then saw the payback uh, on the off, on the operations and maintenance. So that's really where you get your return. Well, keep making a difference, man. I look forward to it, Mark. You know, you're you're a huge contributor towards that. So thank well, you. Well, we'll we will keep talking about it, and I definitely will see you soon. I look forward Thanks. to it. Thanks.